In this problem, we have an oil reservoir that has the dimensions of 1 foot long by 0.5 feet wide and has 4.3 quarts of oil that fill the reservoir to 0.2874 feet. I will list all the values in metric for those of you who think in metric at the bottom. We want to find the change in volume of the oil when it undergoes a temperature change from 68 degrees Fahrenheit to 245 degrees Fahrenheit. We will also be assuming these coefficients of volume expansion of oil. The formula we'll be using is the delta or change of volume equals the volume initial times the expansion coefficient times the delta or change in temperature. What this formula is stating is that if there's an increase in temperature, then there'll be an increase in volume. If the temperature decreases, then the volume will also decrease. So how do we go about solving this one? So it's time to plug and chug. Plugging in our values, we get 0 0.00989 cubic feet, which is the amount the volume increases by. Notice that because the coefficient of expansion is unitless, we can use any unit of volume and get the amount of change in volume. Just be careful to use the correct coefficient of friction if you're using degrees Fahrenheit or degrees Celsius. Also, let's take a moment to admire how much easier it is to work in metric. Now to get the new volume, we can add the initial volume to the expansion volume, which I have done on the right of the screen. Next, we want to get the new height of the oil, which can be found by dividing the volume after heating by the area of the bottom of the reservoir. We get a new height of 0.3072 feet. Just for kicks, let's find the change in height. We can do this by taking the final height minus the initial height. We get about a quarter inch or about six millimeters of height change when the oil is heated to these temperatures. That concludes this video. Hope you have earned a like, share, or subscription. If you enjoyed this video, you may enjoy one of these videos as well. Let me know how I'm doing in the comments down below. Thank you for watching.